Today I'm going to be working on a tuner. It's a tuner by the company NAD and the model number is 402, Stereo Tuner 402. And the problem is, is it plugged in? Uh, yes. Okay, the problem is there's no power evidently. So I'm going to go ahead and open this thing up. So I've actually got the unit um, open and the first thing I notice that there's a strong like a little burnt smell in here although I couldn't see anything um, and so I put my nose closer and it this power transformer has a burnt smell to it although on the outside you really can't see anything so <clears throat> That's probably always the best thing to do is when you open one of these units up is first look around first see if you can't see anything or smell anything like I just did. You couldn't tell the you couldn't uh, smell anything with the cover on but you could once I opened it up I saw oh, oh, oh it smells like something's burnt. So let me go ahead first thing I want to do is uh, check the fuses. Um, See if they're actually good. Of course, I got the the power off and uh, the cords unplugged. So let me go ahead and do that. So, and for that, we just put the meter across the uh, fuse. So that's okay. And now the other one. That's okay too. So uh, next thing I'm going to do is see if I get any voltage coming out of the transformer. Uh, of course the primary side that's where the main voltage comes in from the um, from the line and this is the secondary side. So I'm going to see what I'm getting what I'm getting here. So I'm now going to take a measurement off of the secondary. I'm taking it, um, I removed the fuse, both of the fuses, and I'm taking the voltage now where the, where it comes directly out of the transformer and goes to one end of the fuse. And for good measure here, I don't have yet, but I'm going to go ahead and, this little connector here, this goes straight to the, uh, Looks like the rectifiers here. So now I should be getting something out. Oh, there, there it is. But it's only 1.25 volts, which is not very much. Let me go ahead and <clears throat> check the other side. Of course, I'm going to shut everything off now. Then once I have made the connection again, then I'm going to turn everything back on. This way is safer though too, even though I'm using an isolation transformer. Okay, here we go again. Again, it's 1.27 volts AC and that's unloaded and, and that's definitely not correct. That's probably got something to do with that, um, sm that burnt smell. So now I'm going to check the primary side with the ohmmeter of course my power everything off fact the unit is unplugged and off if I can get this on here okay and um, let me turn the ohmmeter on and it's actually showing me that the transformer is actually um, open so it looks like I got a bad transformer so this concludes this video I think um, the transformer is bad so I'm gonna have to wait till I get a donor unit um, otherwise I'm just gonna have to keep this uh, unit for 
spare parts. It's got a couple things on here that I could possibly use.